All right, Eric. You had uh, two issues. One was a key and transistor was going bad and pretty much was just about bad. And you had a blown transistor. So I went ahead and put you two new HGs in there. Actually, you got you got to get some of the uh, the first HGs they ever released. They're same HGs, just different. That's back when I used to put the ink on them. Now they do a uh, some sort of inf uh, what you call it. They're burnt. The ink the ink's not ink. It's burnt on there. I forget what you call it. But anyway. So you got to get some of the, uh, the HGs before. I still had a couple of them left. I ain't used up. So anyway, man, I threw two new HGs in there for you. I went ahead and replaced the... Uh, and the only reason I do this because my buddy at Texas Star, he tells me to go ahead and do it because he has had issues with 350s going into oscillation. And when he throws these on there, it helps out a lot these the feedback circuits are mainly there to keep a medium bandwidth across the uh, bandwidth of the amplifier you know to keep a medium gain but they also will help with stability so I like to always uh, you know this is a this is a newer Texas star by the way the newer circuit and they you know, unbeef some of the parts, shall I say. So I went ahead and put you two new feedback circuits in there. Also put you two 330 caps in here. They quit putting them in there. And that just uh, will help a little bit with stability as well. But this thing is doing what a 350 is supposed to do now. We're on 14 and a half volts. This is just the bench radio. I ain't even going to grab it with another one. Once you see a 350 doing this, you know it's working right. Alright. This is driving at about 1820 watts. 4 watts RMS. That's the 500 watt slug. This is peak. Looking at the top scale. Uh, middle scale, sorry. Middle scale. No. Almost 400 watts, man. Just hitting it with about 18 to 20. Here's your RMS. A thousand watt slug. Oh, about 150 bird, man. This thing is working great. Oh, I'd be happy with a hundred, to be honest with you. So this thing's working really good. Put your uh, that in. Of course, that's going to enable your variable. She drops to about oh, about a little bit over a hundred bird and peak. Oh. A little bit over 300 peak. So there you go, man. Texas Star 350 makes some of the most beautiful drivers in the game. We got it back up and rolling, man. If you want to, we can just trade those two HGs for that used uh, 2879. That's still good. I know I surely could use it, but I'll ask you about that. If not, I'll send that back to you. All right, big brother. I'm going. Off to the next one.